People are continually asking me if it's safe to handle mushrooms. And it is completely safe. Even a death cap is safe to handle. It's really only harmful if it's ingested. I feel it's important to educate people about fungi because fungi have really gotten a bad rap in Western culture. We're taught to be really fearful of mushrooms. Not all mushroom poisonings are deadly. There's very few deadly species. The vast majority of mushroom poisonings just cause severe gastrointestinal distress. So this is the one that takes people out every year. So this is Amanita phylloides, the death cap. The death cap is California's most notable poisonous mushroom. Although many mushroom poisonings are not deadly, the death cap does cause fatal poisonings each year when people misidentify and then eat them. So this is a really important mushroom to learn uh, and familiarize yourself with. This mushroom is actually considered invasive, so whenever I find it or pick it for educational purposes, I try to throw it in the trash can so I'm not contributing to its spread. Because it is so big and showy, people often pick it up and it gets spread around pretty easily. Oh! Death cap. Death cap. Death cap. But that oh. all, so now smell the fresh one. Oh, that one is an old one? Yeah. You, oh. It still has that smell, it's just not as pungent. It's like a degree of rottenness. Kind yeah. Of. Does it smell? Yeah, it smells like rotting potatoes. They stink. Oh my god. Yeah, so they smell really bad. Um, and the reason people get poisoned from these is because they're all white and they start in this little egg like most mushrooms do. And those features are similar to mushrooms that people in other countries will forage and eat. So when they're in that young button stage, it's hard to see all of the distinct features that indicate that it's the death cap. If I were to cut this mushroom on the stem, I would miss this sac down at the bottom called the vulva. And that is a distinguishing character for Ammonita. So this death cap has all of the characters that help us identify it. It has the vulva, the annulus, and this kind of metallic light green sheen, but that can vary depending on sun exposure. It can be um, almost brown or even a lighter white. And smells like a death cap, rotten potatoes.